I'm excited. Hey. And then take her out. Little feed tray. Hi. Because we will catch everything on fire. She's already getting comfy. What is up, Billings fam? Welcome back, welcome back. Another gorgeous day. I'm really getting used to this weather. I absolutely love it. So, a little recap. The baby chick did awesome last night. She slept in her little aquarium and was great. This morning, we woke her up. Let me take you over there right now. Good morning, Billings fam. Hope everyone had a good night. This is our first morning with our little chick. And we just got her up. We woke her up and got outside. Hey, can you say hi to everybody? Very messy. Lots of, lots of poop in there. So we're outside. We're going to take her out, put her in the sun for a little while. Let her kind of hang out and roam and clean up her, her little uh, enclosure here. And we're going to get to work on a new one for her. But I'm excited, guys. That was a lot of fun having a new little baby. And I think she had some fun, right? Hi. So that was awesome. Today, what we are gonna do though is we are gonna put her in one of the aquariums that we have left over that's a lot larger so she has more space. If you haven't seen the videos where we got those aquariums, make sure you go check that out now. As always, guys, go down, subscribe right now, hit that bell so you can keep up with all these videos we got coming out. Today, we are at Tractor Supply Company. We've wanted to come here for a very long time because we have heard this is the place to be if you do own chickens, ducks, those type of things. So we're gonna go in here. We might get some new food, might get a new little feeder for her. I don't know, we'll see what happens. Who knows, we might come out of here spending a crap load of money on stuff we don't even need. Either way, let's go in there. Let's see what we can get. We're on a mission. We got the little one, perfect size for her. We need the top to this. So Billings fam, we are on a mission to find the top. Let's go. Organic, it's the way to go. Georgie, what do you got? A wipe? Did you tear up a wipe, little girl? I think you is that pig feed? I want a pig. Georgie, you want a pig? Let's get a pig. We are back, Billings fam, at home. We just got back from getting everything we need. No, I am not a cowboy now. I, this is for a special reason. Re reason? Reason, which I'll fill you in in just a minute. But just want a quick update here. So this is the nice big 30 gallon aquarium we are gonna use. It is not gonna be outside. It's just a beautiful day and we don't wanna be inside. So we're gonna set everything up out here and then bring it in. Uh, but this is much larger than the 10 she's in right now. She'll love this inside for, for the time being. And we picked up some other stuff. We got the heat lamp we need, her little feed tray. We got a nice little perch over there. And the cool little frog dish right there is for her greens, you know, her clovers and all the other little uh, outside goodies that she loves. So we got everything there. We're going to get it all set up. And over, where is she? Over there. Got everybody. It's somewhere way over there. She is right now in her, her little playpen area, just taking in the sun. She absolutely loves it. She's having a blast, chasing all the little bugs around. It's pretty cool. Here is the beautiful little baby right here. I hope you guys got a chance to check out the last video. If not, make sure you go do that right now of how we got her. We got her because unfortunately her mother was killed by a fox, which is very sad. So she was an orphan. And I also keep saying she, guys, don't forget, there is a still a slight chance it could be a male. We hope not, because our town, you actually can't keep a rooster. So we're hoping that it's a female so that we can keep her and not have to give her back, because we do love her already. She is just the coolest little thing. Uh, so yeah, unfortunately her mother was killed and she would have been bullied by the other chickens. So we took her in and we're gonna give her all the love that she needs. As you can see right over there, that was her 10 gallon that she's been in. We're gonna upgrade over to the 30 real soon. The one other thing after we get her 30 gallon set, the reason for my bandana, we gotta give this lovely little baby a bath. Uh, it's kind of like a, um, it's to kind of rid her. She still has some lice and little nits. She's almost done. She should be almost done with her treatments. It is gonna be using like a, a medicated stuff that we'll go over once we do that. But for now, let's go get everything set in her new home. All right guys, so the first thing we gotta do, we're gonna line the bottom of her new place with her paper towels, just easier to clean. And right now with her so little, it's just the perfect bedding for her. So we're gonna make sure to do this. We got plenty of them. And we gotta usually change this a couple times a day, but it is, as you can see, super easy to do that. With that being said, the next few things that we got, we were able 
to pick up a bunch of it from the Dollar Tree, which is awesome, super cheap. So if you guys do need to do a brooder, which is what they call these, things similar to this, you can actually do it pretty, pretty cheap and they can stay in that for a good portion of their early life, probably up to about three months, they can stay in a brooder, which is awesome. We got this little thing. We're just gonna see if maybe she'll like to go and sit in that, hide out, sleep, do something. So a couple of the other things we got. So we're actually gonna use this with the little feeder we got. Perfect. We weren't sure if it was gonna work, but it does, which is awesome. So we'll fill the food there and it's gonna come out in a little tray. You can get the mason jar at the Dollar Tree for a buck. And I think the other little feed part was like only a couple bucks at the tractor supply, which is awesome. So this is really cool. This is gonna be the bath when we give, so they take little dirt baths. They only do that about once a week. So we will just put that in there for now. Um, and this, pretty excited about this. She has started to really like perching on things. So, I don't know if you guys noticed too. Pretty funny, but there is a turtle painted on here. We got this, this is one of those tanks from the nature center that we got. It's actually really well done. Unfortunately though, this was just too stained to clean off to use as an aquarium. It wouldn't have looked nice, but it'll be perfect for her. So maybe something like that for right now just so she can kind of jump up and see. Oh, guys, we had to get her a friend. Come on now. Everyone needs a friend sometimes. I think she'll love that. Maybe we'll put it, put it right near that. Which brings me to my next point. Since she needs company, you know what she really likes? A mirror. Everybody likes looking at themselves. But no, in all seriousness, guys, since she doesn't have a mother or any other friends to really cuddle up to, it's really cool. She got the little stuffed animal now and she loves her mirror every night. She literally sleeps right next to this, which is pretty cool. That is like perfect. On. Okay guys, so we moved a couple of things around. Just thought the positioning would work a lot better. So we got our mirror over on this side, kind of like this one we'll call her little sleeping station. So we got all that set up over here and we got our perch set up here just so it's a nice view from the outside. We also, the other big reason I forgot is we have a background that we're gonna put just on this. So we're gonna put it right on the back. I just gotta grab some tape for that. Everything else is coming along. We got the heat lamp, which obviously we're not gonna set up outside, but I did just wanna show you that. So we just bought the new one. So we had all our stuff that Pondering Creations lent to us. Thank you, Eliza. And we're just gonna fix it up a little bit. Thanks, bud. It actually goes right on here. So no one touches the light. Makes a little bit more sense taking the rubber tips off. Cool. So we got our heat lamp, which will be hung up, up, hung up inside. I would say probably around here. Most of the time right now, guys, honestly, it's warm enough in the house where she probably doesn't even need it. But for those nights like maybe tonight, we probably will throw that up for her put her other little food dish in here as well. And then guys, just this, this is the stuff that you would use for the sand, the um, dirt bath, the dust bath, dirt bath, whatever the hell. Uh, play sand, and this is some of the DE, and you don't have to always use that. That is, don't, don't do that. Boom! What up Billings fam, we got it! Looks super, super nice, and look, she's already getting comfy cozy over there. So we got our nice little sleeping station set up over there. We got our greens and our food, our water, everything. The heat lamp is definitely not gonna stay there because we will catch everything on fire, but we are working on getting it set up. Like I said, she really probably does not even need it, but for right now, it can go right there just to keep it a little bit warm. She has been super happy since we put her in here. I'm excited. I hope you guys are excited. Now. We gotta get to some really important news. So today's Good Vibe shout out goes to Brian Reyes, who says, guys, I love the Good Vibe shout out. This world needs more positivity, which I agree. Thank you, Brian. I appreciate the support. I hope all of you guys love what we're doing. I love the positivity. Let's keep it going. Love the nice, beautiful case. Thanks to Tay. Thank you, Tay. Love your case on here. It looks beautiful. But anyways, guys, now we did do her DE bath earlier, and I'm going to leave you with that. All right, guys, so her little dream home is coming out great. I'm very excited for that. Before we leave you today, guys, I'm just going to quickly show you. We do got to give her her bath, her little medicated bath. So it is in stuff called DE, which is diatomaceous earth. 
And this is food grade safe, so it's fine to get on you, but you don't want to inhale it. So that's what my little cowboy bandana was for. It's still not good to inhale. So we just quickly put her in here with it, kind of put some on her head and face, and then take her out. And she will do the rest of the work. And it is perfectly safe for her, so she will be good. Honey, you gotta stay in your box. All right, guys, so make sure, do me a favor. We have a huge journey to go with her and all the turtles and everything else. Subscribe down below. Make sure, hit that bell, guys. Send some comments. We need to know names. Let me know if you have any chickens or any other cool pets. And remember, guys, should we get a chicken or should we get a duck? If you haven't seen that, that was in the other video, but we need an idea for one of those. So make sure to join along. As always, guys, peace. I'm gonna take my horse to the old town road. I'm gonna.